Hi, I have a GE Compressor Motor Model 5 KCR49 on 2401Y. Can you tell me how to change wiring from 230 volts to 115 volts? Hello, can you see the data plate on the motor? Is it rated as a dual voltage motor? It doesn't give an option for dual voltage. It has only one diagram. Okay, then it is likely not an option for this motor. For dual voltage motors there must be a break in the motor windings that are identified and routed to the motor wiring area. How many leads does the motor have? Black and blue connected to L2 white and purple connected to L1 green for ground. I'm sorry, also a black connected to terminal H. Yeah, I don't see an option for switching voltage configurations. You have a dual capacitor set up and those are likely two of those four motor wires. Sorry about that. Not all motors can be reconfigured like what you want to do. Some are designed specifically for one purpose and input voltage. I had a feeling. There is no horsepower rating on the data plate. If I buy a 115V compressor duty motor, what HP do you recommend? Also do I need to change the pressure switch? What's the amperage rating? If after the letter A, 14.0 if after the letters A and B, 40. 14 amps. Okay standby I will calculate HP. That calculates out to be 4.5 horsepower based and 240 volts and an amperage rating of 14 amps. You would want a motor with that same horsepower rating at least and the same RPM and frame, FR. Pressure switch OK. You will have to check the electrical rating. Practically I don't think you will find a 5 horsepower, 120 volt motor for cheaper than a new compressor. I was just thinking the same thing. Thank you Sam for your advice and time. If the pressure switch carries the full amperage of the motor then no it probably won't work. Glad to help. Good luck. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.